was over, they thought I was finished, dawg Whole city jump behind me, now I get more racks than a tennis ball And you know ain't no looking back, the streets brought the hustle out of me I was sick of eating pot of me, ramen noodles all through the week The struggle was ugly, made something out of nothing 78 Chevy boy, man Another day, another cold start, dog. Prepare for takeoff, man so hot in this joint, man. That joint gets so hot. You too, you too. What it do, baby? We hit it again, man. Another day. Another video. More footage, man. We headed up here to the shop right now. It's uh, 10.30. I got a VIP cut, man. I'm gonna go ahead and do this VIP cut. But I got something else in store today, man. We switching it up on Cayenne today, man. We switching it up on Cayenne. I'm gonna tell you why I'm switching it up. How I'm switching it up. Man, we, we finna redo the tent. We finna redo the tent on this joint. Right? We finna redo the tent, man. You know, I got five on my back windows. And I got 20 on my side windows, and I got 35 on the windshield. So, with that being said, I want my stuff darker, man. I want it darker. You feel me? So, I'm going with the five on the sides, man. I'm taking the 20 off the sides, and we're going we're gonna to slap five on that joint. So, we can be smoked out, loped out, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I told you, it's like I got a whole different... It's like I got alter egos when I'm in my two different old schools, right? I told y'all when I'm in when I'm in when I'm in uh I knew this car was gonna do this. Oh, right over in front of me. Man. Yeah, but I like I got two different alter egos, man. I don't got no name for them, but I'ma tell you their personality though. When I'm when I'm in when I'm in uh Penny. I'm on my laid back stuff, man. I'm talking about my two chain, Rick Ross. You know what I'm saying? Cruising through, man, chunking the deuces at, at folks. You know what I'm saying? I be on that vibe when I'm in when I'm in Penny. But man, when I'm in this truck, man, when I'm in Cayenne, I'm on my young, you know, NBA young boy, man. Uh, uh, Kodak Black, Pooh Shiesty, Big Thirty. Man, I'm on all them boys, Lil Migo. I'm on that type of vibe, man. You talking about running from the police, zipping through traffic, man, burning rubber on folks, man. That, that's how I be in that joint, man. We be we be crunking here, man. You know what I'm saying? So I need my windows black. Like on the Chevy, on Penny, I never tint my windows on that box for some reason. It be looking, you know, it be looking good when people do it. But me, I can't do it, man. I can't do it. I gotta be glass out. I gotta be fishbowl with that AC on when I come through there, man. But this truck, for some reason, I tried to go around as long as I could, man, but I'm, I'm pretty much, I, I've had it, I've had it, I've had it up to here with it, man. I gotta go blacker. So hopefully that 5% on the doors give me what I'm looking for by me having a windshield tinted. So we're gonna do a comparison. Uh, not now, cause I'm already late. But when I pull up over my boy house, we'll do a comparison before he take this off. So keep it locked, man. 78 Chevy boy. It's tent change up time, man. Let's get it. Yeah, man. About to deposit this cash. Go get a little gas. And then we're gonna uh, grab me something to drink. I bought my uh my cup with me today. Got my old Arctic cup with me with some ice in it. But, uh, hold on one second. Y'all ever use y'all Apple Watch? Instead of pulling your card out, 
That's what us Apple people can do, man. <laughs> Yeah, but we're gonna, we're gonna deposit this cash. Then we're gonna get us some gas. Then we're gonna get our ass on the slab, man. And go, and go get these windows did, man. It's 11.37. I should get out there in about 15 minutes. It's in Cordova. See, I thought he was right around the corner for me. I thought he was right around the corner for me. But uh, that's cool though. That's cool, that's cool. We finna shoot out here right quick. Stop and give me something to drink, man. Probably another sweet tea. I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be fine, man. Keep it locked, 787 boy. Let's get it. Yeah, man. Putting a little petrol in that thing. Already ran in, got me sweet tea. I was already on a half a tank. I was dead on a half a tank. I'm gonna put uh, put 20 in that junk. We'll see where the, where the hand at. I told y'all, this junk got a big tank on it, man. I never verified it, but it, it got a big tank on it. I know I use premium and all that, but but still. So, the gas at this station, it's a little higher than where I usually go. It's 259 here. So 259 got me 7.69 gallons, man. We finna see. Hold on. Okay. Let's see where we at, man. Let's see where we at. They put me... They put me a little bit past... Past uh, three fours. $20 did from a half. So I know it'll take another ten, twelve dollars man. Yep. 787 boy. Y'all keep it locked, man. We got 14. We got uh we got 15 minutes to get to our destination, man. Let's ride. I-40 East toward Nashville.
got good gas, we got good voltage, we got good tilt, baby. I know I gotta get off on Highway 64. There's a couple of more exits. We got five minutes, baby. Five minutes. Running against time, boy. Don't tell me y'all don't be. Don't tell me y'all don't be uh trying to beat the uh trying to beat the GPS and stuff. GPS say say you gonna get there at ten oh five. Boy, you be running that junk just to make it at ten oh four and make the GPS a lot. <laughs> Take exit 18 for US 64 East toward Somerville, Bolivar. Take exit 18, then keep right at the fork. Three minutes, three minutes. Three minutes, man. Keep right at the fork. on US 64 East for three quarters of a mile. Okay, okay. You ain't saying whether I'm gonna turn right or left, Siri. You ain't telling me if I'm gonna turn right or left, Siri. I need to know this. I need to know this, Siri. I need to know this. We'll be right back, y'all. I'm gonna be turning right. I'm gonna be turning right, man. three people houses out here and all of them stay off this street here this street i gotta turn right on in a quarter mile turn right onto berry hill road one minute one minute one minute y'all i ain't gonna show exactly where turn right onto berry hill road Destination, man. We at the destination. It's 1201. 1201, man. I told y'all I was gonna shave it down though. Y'all see what's going on. 78 Chevy boy, man. Keep it locked. Yeah, we finna do the comparison, man. Y'all see from the front. You pretty much can't see anything from the front. But in the inside right there, you can see. You can see through that door a little bit. Probably can see through both doors a little bit. See where it get lighter. It gets lighter right there. That's the door. But on the side, you can clearly see through that joint. Y'all see through it? See the garage door over there? I want it black, man. So when I be coming through, people can see a silhouette of me up in the truck. I don't want none of that. See, it's already five on the back one. Back one to smoke. You can't see nothing through the back window. So, I think that 5% on the door is gonna get me what I'm looking for with the 35 on the windshield. We'll see in a minute, man. Pull it back out. That's my mount right there. That's my GoPro mount. We'll see you in a minute. 78 Chevy Boy, keep it locked, man.
shit, man. Out with the old. Yeah. Gonna be in with the new, man. Oh yeah, all angles, auto care in detail. Did I get it right? Yes, sir. All angles, auto care in detail, man. My little homie Trail, man. That's who did my windshield on this truck. And uh, man, we coming off with that twenty percent, man. I need that. I need that five, man. Black out. Yeah, you gotta black it out, man. So I already showed y'all how it looked when it was on the street that you can you can see through. You can see clean through that five. But we finna see what it looked like. I mean you can see clean through that 20 I had on there. So we finna see what it looked like with this five on here. So I'll probably do a couple time lapses and uh and show y'all the, the finished product, man. Y'all keep it locked. 787 boy, drop a comment right now. Let me know where you from. What's the what's the uh state laws on tent where you at, man? Can you have a dog? Can you ride it with on the windshield? Let me know what y'all got going in your state. Like, what are your laws? Cause I had a guy yesterday ask me. Uh, he was like, "Can I?" He said, "You can ride with the Chevy Heartbeat of America tag on the front." I was like, "Yeah, down here they only require require you to have a a, a tag in the back." Then he was like, he was like, man, he, he said, he was like, I'm from, I'm from some, I forgot what part of Texas, but he was like, I'm from Texas. Can I ride with one on the front of mine? I was like, bro, the states, the laws vary from state to state. So you need to check your, uh, you know what I'm saying? His, uh, tag, his, his other tag. Well, I know in Chicago, they got to have two tags, you know, front and back. But, you know, down here where we from, Arkansas, Mississippi. One tag, shot. One tag, man. Tennessee, I know I Georgia. They, they won't even let them four have them Johnson in their windshield. Like put their uh, regular tag in the windshield. Uh -huh. They won't even let them do that. Yeah. My officer, he tried that. He ain't tasted too? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, it varies, man. So, y'all let me know the tent laws where y'all at and uh, and how you riding your car. Do you, if y'all got strict tent laws, do you still book the system? Be like, whatever, I'm still going to keep mine dark. But here, it's laws against it. Some police mess with you, some don't. I've been pulled over several times in my Tahoe and, and they let me go once they run that run that license and see I ain't got nothing going on. Try to find something else. Yeah, that's what it be. Once they see I'm straight as an arrow, man, they man, go ahead on. You know what I'm saying? I ain't I done got pulled over more times in my Tahoe about my tent than I have them profiling me when I'm in my box. Cause you would think my box, so I get pulled over a lot in the in the in the box. You gonna work on your box? It looked like somebody put some time into it. Right, it right, right, like right. Something <laughs> yeah. I bought through some big wheels on and I'm riding. It right. looked like something somebody put some real time into. It. Just like this jump. Mm -hmm. So they were like, well, he can't be up to no good. Right, right, right. It's not just too clean. Like yeah. a tire or something. I get pulled over in man. I think a tow a tow is like one of the target vehicles, man. That's what I think. Had a lot of stuff in. Yeah. <laughs> like, like her truck in uh -huh. my car. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on even. Yeah. Them no you know what I'm saying? The little laces I got. You know, I be scooting around in that joint. Never had no problem, man. They tie hold on. Oh, like, I got police stickers on that joint in the head. I'm be like. Bro, believe it or not, I think I told the story before. Man, it was around when I was working on American Way, man, at the barber shop. It was one police, bro. Within a year, bro, I know this man pulled me over six times. Within a year? Within a year. And this particular time, I'm talking about, bro, I was headed to work a Tuesday morning, right there, going down Kirby, finna jump on the slab. I actually had went under the vat out and was right there on the ramp. He jumped, he got me Tuesday morning, as soon as I let the window down. Uh, can I see a license? Registration, so I give him a license. Uh, man, you been, you been smoking? You been smoking weed? I said, man, I don't know what you what you own or what you trying to do. I'm not the dude you looking for or, or who you think you got. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But long story short, he ended up letting me go because he ain't had nothing. I don't, I don't smoke nothing. That's it. Let me try to act like I got private cars on my right. body cam. Right, right. But listen, Wednesday morning, <laughs> I'm riding down Kirby. I get in the, in the turning lane. I see him. Turn their lights on and buck another car to get behind me. Man, the man got me. Nigga got me on the same ramp the next morning, bro. Soon as I let the one out, that was, what the first thing he said? 
You been smoking? I said, bro, you don't remember me from yesterday? <laughs> he said, no, nah, man. Uh, let me see your license. He said, he said I pull over, over 30 cars a day. I said, bro, you this brown Tahoe, this big Tennessee toy stick in the back. You don't remember it. And I had my phone call. I think he saw my phone call that day on the on the uh on the armrest. Black guy, bro. Bro, you know they the white guy. Bro, dude, some serious. Pulled me over with my family in the truck one day. But as soon as I let out the window down, he walked up to the truck. Oh, you can go ahead. He ain't even say nothing to me that day, bro. I'm telling you, dude, on something, man. He look like a... Uh, trying to focus. Yeah, little bald head, short, muscle muscle head, man. I'm talking about... Right, you no, know, them be the ones that get punked. Yeah, in school and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people be thinking that shit a joke. That shit be for real. Yeah, it's a mental thing. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? They get their head whooped and shit in school. Yeah. And when they get home, yeah, I can do what I want to do now. Yep. They trying to get some payback. Yeah. Like I used to say, I had told girlfriend about the day. Hey, I was like, man, Eminem was, you know, mm -hmm. when North Memphis was North Memphis. Yeah. But that's what I'm going to hit you, bro. Yeah. Because <laughs> someone be on it, bro. It's just because you calling and messing with people for no reason. Yep. Just like he, like he said, he remember you. He don't pull up no 30 cars. I don't know that man. Probably got pull up 30 cars. Hey, now, if he do, that really says something else about him. You really got a problem, man. He be doing something good. You know what I'm saying? You put no 30 cars. Then you put no cars and let him go. Yep. At least make it worth your while. You know what I'm saying? Like, he could at least get you a ticket or something. If he going to keep working with you. Bro, I can keep naming him, bro. That's three times. <laughs> The, the fourth time, I was right there. Hey, got all work. I was still working at uh, on American Way. The man came. He pulled me over on Reigns and Kirby. Right there. It used to be a Walgreens, but it's a, it's a beer supply store now. Yep. Right there on that corner. So, man, dude was like, he said the same thing then, bro. I had my barber smock on then. The other days, I had like a button up. That's when dude had her wearing the button up with the bow tie and shit. Yeah. But uh, I had my barber smock on, bro. Dude had me with license and stuff. Then he said, you been smoking. He said, man, I smell, I smell marijuana, man. I, could, could you step out the vehicle? I said, what? So me, not wanting to resist and nothing like that. I said, all right. Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. So when I get out, nigga, I ain't finna run. I ain't never got handcuffed, bro. This my first time ever in life being handcuffed. He handcuffed but, you too? Yeah, because I stood by the truck. He like, nah, uh, uh, let me put my, put my cuffs on you for your safety and mine. I'm like, man, I don't know what you wrong, bro. So when he handcuffed me, I tried to lean on the car. He like, nah, I'm gonna need you to sit in the in the car. He put me in the back of the car. So I got my feet hanging out now. He like, nah, I need you to put your feet in. I'm finna unlock, I'm finna close the door. I said, bro, you arresting me? No, you're not on the arrest, you're being detained. <laughs> man, I ain't served my truck and stuff. Get back out. Now, man, you when he got out, I don't know what he was doing, but he was standing there. And then another car pulled up. I don't know if this is Sergeant or whatever. It was a white boy. Mm -hmm. So by the time he pulled up, the man hurried up and took the handcuffs off me. And by the time the white boy got to him, he asked him, like, what's going on? The man going to give me my license, bro, and, like, sh like push me on, like, yeah. push me out, like, like, you can go ahead, you can go ahead. Bro, he made me go and get in the truck, dog. I don't know what he told that man or whatever. He let me go. But I'm like, man, dude, when the pulled up, what was dude about to do? You know what I'm saying? You finna plant something on me? Yeah, like make you have some. Man, bro, that man, these folk the same. You, you wouldn't know your other car. I was in my Tahoe. I was in my Tahoe again, bro. I'm, I literally been pulled over it, within a year of time, bro. I've been pulled over by dudes six times, dog. I heard a and every time I was gonna do it, but I know I knew a police. I used to cut him at the time. And I was asking him, and I would tell him he, you know, he said he didn't know him, but he like, yeah, you can make a report. You know, you can go up there. Did you get his badge number? I like, nah, I ain't get it. I ain't get it off the car and then, but my thing was if I ever see him again, gonna I was gonna get it and report it. But man, I just no, nah, I never seen him. And I was just like, man, I'm gonna charge to the game, man. Yeah. It's yeah. better this thing. I got one over here that be messing with me. For real. He was until I found out where he stayed at. Yeah. But he was uh Coming through without me working. Remember I told you I had that, I had that problem for missing me working? Y'all hear the Amazon cat? Y'all hear him? That's the Amazon cat, man. He bumping. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all hear him? I don't blame him, man. You gotta make the job fun, man. Y'all hear him? 
window removed. One window knocked down. You knock the other, not now. Cause removal. Yeah, I'm black everything, man. I'm going black suede headliner. Still on the fence about the roof. Cause, cause the size I want in it, I ain't, you know, I want something big. You want big size? Yeah, but you know, people around here ain't doing no big ones. Oh, you applying it now? Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's your little dog, the boy. And this from the inside. <laughs> it's, it's, it's. Big, big difference between 20 and 5, boy. Uh, real different, bro. <laughs> I try to tell people all the time it's a, it's a good difference. But the film ain't cheap. So, uh -huh. you should be able to see. Yeah. You should be able to see. But I, I like Fido. That's, what, that's what's on my towel. Cause once I change the windshield out, I'm gonna get you to change do the windshield in my Tahoe too. Yeah, do it, baby. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, man, you got one one window knocked down already. I ain't even gonna show y'all what it looked like, cause we up under here anyway. <laughs> You'll see the real deal once he bag it out. You'll see what it really look like. He working though, he working. So maybe shave your boy, man. Y'all just first time looking at my page or you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, man. Put Turn, turn your notification bell on all so you can see everything I post, man. I be posting pictures. I be making polls, I, you know what I'm saying? I do different stuff. I be posting on my stories. Keep it locked. What's up? Gonna pull that thing out, man, so y'all can see it. Ooh-wee. Get ready, man. Get ready. I think she smoked out. She smoked out now, dog. She smoke now, man. <laughs> she smoke now, dog. Yeah. She smoke now, dog. Can, can you see through that window now? That what I. That's the look I'm looking for, man. That's the look I'm looking for. Gangster. Gangster, man. That what that what I'm looking for, right there. Huh? Oh yeah. See, I, that that was bothering me. You know, when I pass through, I know people can see a silhouette of me through that joint. Ain't none of that now, boy. It was the daytime. Yeah, yeah. Y'all see it, man? Let me pay the man so I can get up out of here, man. Let me pay the man. All right. Y'all keep it locked, man. Seven eight Chevy boy, man. We hopped in, man. Little trail. He wanted to show me, show me what he got up his sleeve, man. Y'all see it, man. That's that's what we coming to now, man. Whole lot of LS stuff going on, man. Everybody jumping LSs, man. He got him a 6 -0. Got him a 6 -0, man. Let me show y'all what he putting it in, though. Hold on. Y'all know me. I love projects, bro. Y'all know Cayenne was a project. Y'all saw it when I first bought it. 
Let me show y'all what he about to put it in. OBS, man. What year is it? 90. 90. OBS, man. And I love them two-tone. My brother, brother-in-law, he got a two-tone. It's the blue. It's the light blue, silver, light blue. That's my favorite. That's my favorite color. Yeah. Yeah, I like them, man. You can come back with this color and be hard. Shoot. You can come with this color and be hard, bro. Candy World, where I got my truck painted, they just painted one that was burgundy, burgundy, uh, silver, and burgundy. Yeah, he put he got some of them them rally rims. I'm gonna pull it up. I'm gonna show it to you. He got some of them rally rims. You talking about? Yeah, bro. Hey, yeah, that's how I was when I bought mine. See though, this the original dash in this night crack. Bro, you ought to see mine got a cover on. You see up under mine, you'll be like, God dang! I'm talking about nigga, it's it's rotten, but that cover make a big difference. They show you this truck was taken care of, the dashboard, and this truck's solid. Everything up, everything is there, man. Y'all see it, man? As he progress, like I say about everybody, as they progress, they ain't got to do them to hit me up so I can update y'all, man. Oh yeah, <laughs> so I can update y'all, man. Yeah, already and good. It's a roller. Hey, man, we're going to keep an eye on this one, y'all. We're going to definitely keep an eye on this one. And he said, I just, I just, you know, I just turned it up a little bit for him. <laughs> just a little bit when we came around the corner. He was like, yeah, that's all I need. That's all I need. Yeah, he said he just want to play, man. He ain't trying to be no big racer or nothing. Yeah, yeah, you sure do be on them bikes, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, man. Ooh, smell like racing gas in this mug. Y'all see what's going on, man? He said, "Y'all want to go fast? If he ever want to go fast, he can jump on one of these." Y'all see what's going on, man? Me and little trail, man. All angles. I don't care in detail, man. Same day, Chevy boy. Y'all keep it locked. My seven, my seven, my seven. I'm dipping in my seven, my seven, my seven. I'm bouncing in my seven, my seven, my seven. I'm riding in my seven, my seven, my seven.